Okay, hi everyone. So today let's uh, discuss this interesting problem. So it says a wheel is uh, making revolutions about its uh, axis with uniform angular acceleration. Starting from rest, it uh, reaches 100 revolution per second in 4 seconds. Find the angular acceleration. Find the angle rotated uh, during these 4 seconds. Fine. So there is a wheel which is axis ke about uh, revolution. Kar hai. And uh, it is given that it is moving with uh, uniform angular acceleration. So alpha will be constant. Right. Starting from rest means initial angular velocity that will be 0. It reaches 100 revolution per second. See, 1 revolution means 2 pi radian, right? So 100 revolution means 200 pi radian. So final omega will be 200 pi radian per second. And uh, time is also given, that is 4 seconds. So first we have to find out angular acceleration, right? So you can uh, simply use uh, omega final is equal to omega initial, means omega naught plus alpha into t. So omega final is uh, 200 pi that is equal to initial omega 0 alpha into time is 4 second. So from here you will get uh, alpha that is 50 pi radian per second square or you can also divide it by 2 pi then uh, you will get uh, uh, 25 right revolution per second square that is the value of alpha. Uh, find the angular acceleration, find the angular angle uh, rotated during these 4 seconds, fine. So now you can use, uh, you know, omega final square minus uh, omega initial square that is equal to 2 into alpha into theta. So this is the angle rotated during these 4 seconds, right? So final omega kitna hai? Final omega is uh, 200 pi, right? It's a square minus initial omega is 0 uh, that uh, divided by 2 into alpha alpha is 25 no, not 25 it is uh, 50 pi right so it will be 50 pi that is the angle in radian right and you can divide it by 2 pi to get uh, in revolutions uh, you know kitna revolution hai during these 4 seconds or aap isko is tarah se bhi kar sakte ho theta is equal to ut plus half of at square right is tarah se so yahan pe initial omega 0 hai so ut 0 ho gaya half of alpha ka value kitna ho jayega 50 pi right into t square will be 4 4 square this much radian right and uh, if you want to find out number of revolution you can divide it by 2 pi fine i think uh, you have understood let me know if you still have any confusion we can discuss further okay guys keep working hard best of luck bye